Katie here with your Galco TV Tech Tip. Touch screens today come in two main varieties, resistive and conductive. Resistive touch screens use two flexible sheets of material that have an electrically resistive coating with a gap separating the two sheets. Voltage travels across the two sheets with one of them detecting the horizontal location of the touch and the other detecting the vertical orientation of the point of contact. Upon applying pressure to the top sheet of a resistive display, it flexes inward towards the second sheet. When they come into contact with each other, a circuit completes. Because these displays only need pressure to register a touch, you can use anything to press the screen and get a result. Software will then determine the touch locations. Resistive screens are often found in ATMs or dashboard units in cars. Capacitive touch screens are what you will commonly see in modern smartphones and tablets, and they do not rely on pressure at all to determine input. A layer of the screen is coated with a conductive material and a small amount of voltage is applied to the conductive layer to create an electrostatic field. When something conductive, such as your finger, touches the screen, a tiny electrical charge is transferred to your finger to complete the circuit, which creates a voltage drop at that point of the screen. Software will then process the location of this voltage drop and act accordingly. Stay tuned to Galgo TV for more tech tips.